Florida Republican Congressman Trey Rada walking out of Hazelden Addiction and Treatment Center in Naples this evening and right into that press conference to answer questions about his use of cocaine and alcohol while on the job in Washington, D.C. Four Under Corners' Warren Wright has more on what Rada was willing to answer and what he didn't. Warren? Well, Congressman Radel says his problems all stem from alcohol. When asked about cocaine, the quantity, and who he did it with, and how many times, his answers weren't as straightforward. Here's exactly what I know. Alcohol does not work for me. Congressman Trey Radel was forthcoming about his addiction to alcohol, insisting that cocaine is not a problem for him. And when asked specifically if he ever used cocaine in Southwest Florida, his answer was simple. No. But as for many of the other questions regarding his drug use, his answers not as direct. Like how many times did he use cocaine? A handful of times. I've been treated for the disease of alcoholism. Alcohol is my issue. It should be noted that Radel was caught purchasing an eight ball of cocaine as well as having a stash of cocaine in his house. He was allegedly ratted out by a dealer who got caught up in a sting operation. When asked about possessing so much of the narcotic and how it seemed surprising for someone who was just experimenting, he wouldn't address it directly. I was treated clinically for the disease of alcoholism. Alcohol has been my issue and has led to bad decisions, and that's why I'm here today talking with you all. And how about the mystery person that was with him the night he was arrested for attempting to buy cocaine? Again, no answer. No lobbyist, no aid, no staff, nothing at all. It's a private person, and I'm going to leave it that way. One question he did seem sure about, despite all the cocaine and alcohol, Radel insists he was able to do his job effectively. Never, it never interfered with my congressional obligations. This was my personal issue on personal time. Now, Radel says his recovery is continuing and ongoing, which will include lifestyle changes and daily meetings. Warren Wright, Fox 4, in your corner.